Hi, in this video, I will read about providing spiritually. Even providing spiritually, there are 10 through 16, that's Let's see, 10, 11, okay, I'll just start. Some paragraphs, 10 through 16. Even more essential than providing materially is providing spiritually. Jesus said, man must live not on bread alone, but on every utterance coming forth through Jehovah's mouth. Matthew 4, 4 and 5 and 3. Uh, 5, 3. What can you parents do to provide spiritually? On this subject, perhaps no passage of scripture is quoted more often than Deuteronomy 6, 5 through 7. Please open your Bible and read those verses. Uh, I'll skip that for now. Note that parents are first told to cultivate their own spirituality, building love for Jehovah and taking his words to heart. Yes, you need to be a serious student of God's word, reading the Bible regularly and meditating on it so that you can develop a real understanding of and love for Jehovah's ways. Uh, love for Jehovah's ways, principles and laws. As a result, your heart will be full of fascinating Bible truths that will move you to feel joy, awe, and love for Jehovah. Awe is A-W-E, awe and love for Jehovah. You will have an abundance of good things to impart to your children. Luke 6.45 Spiritually strong parents are prepared to apply the counsel found at Deuteronomy 6-7 to inculcate Jehovah's words in their offspring at every opportunity. To inculcate means to teach and impress by means of repetition. Jehovah well knows that all of us, children in particular, need repetition in order to learn. Thus Jesus used repetition in his ministry. For example, when teaching his disciples to be humble instead of proud and competitive, he found a variety of ways to repeat the same principle. He taught by reasoning, by illustrating, even by demonstrating. Matthew 18, 1 through 4, Matthew 20, 25 through 27, John 13, 12 through 15. Remarkably, though, Jesus never showed impatience. Similarly, parents need to find ways to teach basic truths to their children. Patiently repeating Jehovah's principles until the children absorb and apply them. Mm -hmm. Family study sessions are ideal locations for such teaching. Indeed, a regular upbuilding happy family. <laughs> Timothy is interrupting me here. Come on, Timothy. Ta -da, ta -da, ta -da. You're saying hello? All right, let's continue. Oh, 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 oh. It's about to fall down, even the cat. Oh, my goodness, Timothy. All right, Timothy. Let me do it here. Oh, Timothy. <laughs> 
Oh my goodness, Timothy, you really want attention. Kittens need attention. Kittens need attention, right, Timothy? Children need attention. Timothy needs attention. And Daniel needs attention. Ah. Oh. Well done, my friend. All right, and you're back for more. All right, I'll continue this video in a moment. <laughs>